Hey guys, so good to see you. I'm wanting to just take a deeper dive into to this week's blog, okay? So if you haven't read it yet, at lisaconnery.com, I go through really my five areas that I'm focusing right now on so that I can continually be adapting. Because adaptability is the name of the game right now. Our circumstances, our lives, like the norm has changed. And that is out of our control. So stop trying to control that and resist that and accept it. And acceptance does not mean defeat. Just accept it so that you can move on and control only the, th the way that you react to it, the way that you choose to grow, the way that you choose to see life happening for you. So right now, I'm wanting to encourage you to do your best, to be your best, whatever that looks like. Every single day, commit to being your best. And I get it. Sometimes being my best requires me giving, hey, mama needs a time out. I need a time out and I need some time to myself so that I can come back feeling recharged, excited, enthusiastic about my life and the people I'm with so that I can come back feeling more patient and having more compassionate and love for them. So being your best and doing your best can look so differently and this is maybe a lesson for you to connect to like, who do I, what do I need to be my best today? Because if you've been giving and giving and giving and not taking any time for you through self-care and rest, you can't give from a place of emptiness. You're going to fall short and you're also going to be exhausted and deflated at the end of all of this. I want you coming out of this stronger. So what does that look like to commit to being your best and to doing your best every single day? Be flexible and open to what that can look like, but you'll see that you'll be more resourceful and creative when it comes to the problems and creating amazing solutions that are going to help you grow out of this stronger than you were. You are so worthy of this. This is a calling for a lot of us. It's time for us to grow into the person that we are meant to be. And that doesn't happen in the fluff and the perfectness. It happens when it's tough, when it's scary. When it's uncertain, the groundlessness of it all, that's when it's scary and that's when you need to look your fear in the eye and see it and have the courage to do it anyway. Have the courage to become the person that you were meant to be and share your gifts and live your purpose. I love you so much. Check out the blog for the rest of my focuses. I know it's going to help you. It's been helping me so much. We're going to come out of this stronger, guys. We're all in this together. Love you.